Hey everyone, happy Friday. This is my Stop and Shop couponing haul for the week of November 11th through the 17th. I was able to get some great deals today, the first day of the sale at Stop and Shop. I end up spending a total of $24.66 out of pocket. I received back $14.65 through various rebate apps, which makes the net purchase price $10.01 for everything here. Okay, so the first item here is the Milo's Kitchen Dog Treats. They were on sale for $3 a piece this week. I purchased two, which comes to $6. I had two a dollar off of one printable coupons from coupons.com and two a dollar off of one load to card coupons, which both came off. So I got a total of $4 in savings off of the $6, which makes them a dollar a piece. The Swanson stock and broth is on sale this week. The stock is $2. The broth is $1.99. I don't know why Stock and Shop did that. They are playing with my emotions. Um, there's a promotion going on with these items as well. Spend 20 and save 5 Unfortunately, I was only able to find 8 of the stock at $2. And so I had to resort and get the broth at $1.99. So I was 2 cents short of reaching the $20 in order to save five. So I just added the can of broth, which was 60 cents. Again, you spend 20 and save five. And here it is in the circular. There's other items participating in the deal as well. But stock is something that I use a lot, not only to make homemade soup, but to cook rice, to make sauce, and especially since Thanksgiving and Christmas is on the horizon, it is definitely an item that will be used most likely by the end of the year. So again, I purchased eight of the stock at two dollars, two of the broth at one ninety nine, and one can at sixty cents. Brings me to twenty dollars and fifty eight cents. I had ten of the fifty cents off coupons available on coupons.com. It is fifty cents off of one, which does double to a dollar off. So that was $10 in printable coupon savings, minus the $5 for spending 20. And then I had a load to car coupon for 40 cents off of one stock or broth. 10 cartons in one can, only $5.18. The Progresso Soups and the Limpton Recipe Secrets are on sale this week. When you purchase 12, they are 75 cents a piece. I purchased 10 cans of soup and two boxes of recipe secrets. 10 cans at 75 cents a piece comes to $7.50. And the two Limpton secrets at 75 cents a piece comes to $1.50. $7.50 plus one fifty is $9 for 12 products. I had five 50 cents off of two Progresso product coupons that did double to a dollar off. So that was $5 in savings. I had a load to car coupon for a dollar off of three soups. I had the Limpton manufacturer coupon for 60 cents off of two, which did double to a dollar twenty, along with the load to car Limpton coupon for 60 cents off. So I had <coughs> really a boo? Really? Hey boo, say hi. Yay. Okay. So a dollar twenty out of pocket for those 12 items. And then after rebates, I had a dollar back on Saving Star for purchasing three cans of Progresso, a dollar back on Ibotta for purchasing two Limpton Recipe Secrets, and then 60 cents back on Saving Star for purchasing two Recipe Secrets, and then 10 cents back on Moby Save for purchasing a can of soup. So it comes out to be a dollar and 50 cents money maker. Great deal. It's that time of year, you guys, to stock up on soup. The cheese was also part of a spend promotion. Spend 15, save 5. I ended up buying four of the sliced variety and two of the shredded variety. The slices were on sale this week, two for six. I purchased four of them, so four at $3 a piece is 12 I had four 55 cents off coupons that did double to $1.10, so that was $4.40 in savings, which equals $7.60. 
for the slices. The shredded cheese was two for five this week, so two of them is five dollars. Minus a dollar off a two printable coupon that is no longer available, and a dollar off a two load to car coupon that I had equals three dollars. So for all six packages of cheese, it comes to ten dollars and sixty cents. The instant savings of five dollars off brings it to five dollars and sixty cents out of pocket. Of course, I also had rebates on 51. There's a dollar cash back when you purchase two of the shredded varieties. And on Ibotta, there is a 50 cents cash back when you purchase the ultra thin sliced variety. So it came to a net purchase price of $4.10, which is a great deal for six packages of cheese. Okay. You guys, this is my favorite deal this week at Stop and Shop. I was able to get six packages of cookies and crackers from the wonderful company of Nabisco for only 66 cents. After coupons, after load the card coupons, and of course after rebates. 11 cents for each pack, which is absolutely, I feel, unheard of. This is a great deal. If you have the coupons, definitely go out and stock up, you guys. It's that time of year where people are entertaining. Again, the holidays are coming, and so I feel like we go through snacks quicker than usual. I purchased two Oreos, as you can see. Um, everything was on sale for $3 a piece. So I purchased two Oreos, two of the Nutter Butters, and two of the Ritz Crackers. Aren't the Snowflake varieties cute? I can't even deal. So again, they were all $3 a piece. I purchased in pairs of two because of the rebates on 51. I'll explain a little later. Um, so it comes to $6 for the Oreos. I had a $1.50 off manufacturer coupon. Actually a 75 cents off one that doubled and here it is. When you purchase two cookie or cracker products. So that doubled to $1.50 off, and I also had a $1.15 off load to card coupon. So the Oreos came to $3.35. The Nutter Butters, I had the $0.75 cents off coupon as well again, which doubled to $1.50 off, bringing them to $4.50. The Ritz Crackers, again, two of them comes to $6 minus the $0.75 cents off coupon. That doubles, takes off $1.50. There was also an end ad coupon for Ritz crackers. Limit of one, you get one box for $1.88. Again, they're on sale for $3, so the end ad coupon takes off $1.12. I am just so used to the coupons from the ads not scanning, so I automatically called over the self checkout attendant. She came over, she tried to scan it, it did scan, but when she hit finish and pay, we didn't see any indication of it coming off. So she ended up putting it in manually but when my receipt printed, I realized that the coupon came off twice. So I lucked out there. The Ritz came to $2.26. So for all six, after my coupons, it came to $10.11. Now, Ibotta has an exclusive rebate for Stop and Shop only. $5 back. <clears throat> I'm sorry, you guys. I don't know what's going on. $5 back when you purchase five Nabisco products. Um, they have to be... Two dollars and one cents or more, so I got five dollars back there, and then fifty one has rebates for a dollar fifty dollar fifteen back on every two Nabisco snacks. So for every two Oreos, you can claim for a dollar fifteen back. For every two Nutter Butters, you can claim a dollar and fifteen cents back. Ritz and other varieties too. Definitely check out the rebates because it's not only these three products. And so I got back $1.15 for every two on 51 which is $3.45 and then I'm going to receive a dollar bonus next Friday for claiming the $1.15 rebate three times. So after all those savings and rebates it comes out to be 66 cents, which is 11 cents a piece. Absolutely, again, an amazing deal. My favorite deal this week. The Knorr 
pasta or rice sides. I ended up getting the rice sides. They're on sale this week for 88 cents. I purchased four. We have a coupon available on coupons.com. Buy one, get one free. So definitely print those out if you haven't yet already. Four at 88 cents a piece comes to $3.52. Again, I had two of the BOGO buy one, get one free printable coupons, which took off 88 cents each. And then the load to card buy one, get one free coupon took off the retail price for these, which is a dollar. So I paid 76, 76 cents out of pocket. And on Ibotta, there's a dollar back rebate when you purchase three. So it ended up being a 24 cents money maker. Um... So yeah, you guys, this is my stock and shop trip for the week of November 11th, 2466 out of pocket. I already got my rebates back on Ibotta and 51. The ones that I was concerned about is definitely 51 for the Nabisco products and Ibotta and those already cleared within minutes. So definitely I can confirm the deal. Also, you guys, this week, the Barilla Fresh Pasta excluding the filled is on sale this week buy one get one free i wasn't sure how much one was so i did price it when i was in the store today and one is 2.99 now these coupons here are no longer available but 75 cents off which will double to a dollar 50 off one is 2.99 so three bucks when you purchase two of them use two coupons equals free pasta so i will definitely be getting that deal later on in the week. So definitely check your coupon binder, your coupon box, and see if you have any more of those coupons left. Again, they're no longer available to print. Well, you guys, thank you for watching. Definitely follow me on Instagram. I do have an Instagram. I will link it in the description box below. It is a new account. So I don't know if that's the reason that my hashtags aren't working. And what I mean by that is when I do hashtag stop and shop deals, um, it doesn't show up in the thread. And it's frustrating. So hopefully that works itself out. I did report the problem to Instagram. We will see if they do anything. Hopefully they do. Thank you guys for watching. And remember, the coupon game never sleeps.